Here we go with China's amazing transportation mega projects and innovation. Hi, good day to everyone. This is Arthur. And of course, Richard Aguilar here. And we are back again today to give you another awesome video. So if you don't want to miss any of our great contents, be sure to subscribe and push the bell icon. So today, we are counting down our picks for China's super amazing transportation mega projects and innovation taking place in the country. And since we don't want to waste any more of your time, let's get into our video. Number 9 is China's first automatic driving heavy duty train started operation. China's first automatic driving heavy duty train started operation in northwest China and is capable of carrying over 10,000 tons of goods. The first train consists of 108 carriages with a total length of 1,530 meters and carries over 10,000 tons of coal. The train departed from Shenmu Bay Station in northwest China's Shaanxi Province and arrived at Shuzhou City, north China's Shaanxi Province. Number 8 is China's first cable state bridge with lattice towers open to traffic. The Baoji Land Port Bridge, China's first cable state bridge with lattice towers open to traffic in Baoji City, northwest China's Shaanxi Province. The bridge is 1,272 meters long and 37 meters wide, with six lanes in both directions. The steel tower of the bridge is 96.5 meters high. Number 7 is China open to new high-speed rail lines. Mind the gap, more trains are coming. Two new rail lines are now operating in East China's Jiangsu, linking some of the northern regions under developed areas to the country's high-speed rail network for the first time. Watch. Number 6 is, watch how to construct a tunnel through tough terrain. Construction of the major expressway in southwest China's Sichuan province made a major breakthrough. The safe and successful detonation allows work to commence on a tunnel passing through tough terrain. Once completed, the new 230-kilometer long road will connect Sichuan's Panjihua city with Dali city of Yunnan province.
Number 5 is New High Speed Railway Enters Service in Central China. A high speed railway linking Zhengzhou in Henan with Xiangyang in Hubei enters service. The high speed line extends 389 km. It's part of a longer line connecting Zhengzhou with Chongqing municipality. The design max speed is 350 km per hour. Citizens along the line can enjoy bullet train rides as well as the comfort and convenience that come with it. Number 4 is the highest supporting bridge of Chengdu Guiyang High Speed Railway. Bridges were built for the bullet trains to traverse in mountainous areas in southwest China. The highest pier of the 652.2 meter long Xiangbahe Grand Bridge. It's an important part in China's plan to build a high speed railway network across the country. Number 3 is World's Longest Double Deck Suspension Bridge Opened in China The World's Longest Double Deck Suspension Bridge opened to traffic in Wuhan, the capital of China's central province of Hubei. The Yangtzegang Yangtze River Suspension Bridge spans 1,700 meters, making it the second largest suspension bridge in the world as well as setting the record for longest double deck suspension span. Number 2 is Picturesque View of Gojigo Bridge in Xinjiang, China Awesome Aerial View of Gojigo Bridge in Xinjiang, China The Gojigo Bridge in the Xinjiang Uyghur Autonomous Region is a key stop on the Silk Road, which connects Asia and Europe. Spanning 360 meters and erected at an altitude of 200 meters above the valley, it runs across the snowy mountains in winter, offering an astonishing view. Number 1 is High Speed Railway Connects Tourist Spots in Southwest China A new high speed railway linking Chengdu and Guiyang in Southwest China has started test runs. The railway links the capital of Sichuan province and the capital of Guizhou province. It connects such tourist attractions as Wangoshou Waterfall, Mount Emei and Leshan Giant Buddha.
And that concludes this video for today. So don't forget to like this video, subscribe and share this with others. Once again, this is Arthur. And of course Richard Aguilar here. Thanks, Thanks for watching and have a wonderful day. day.